A Corktown neighborhood dealing with a big problem after thieves helped themselves to air conditioners at a town count town house complex. Priya man shows us what the warmer temperatures now expected. Those missing AC units are causing a big hassle for residents. These AC units are a hot commodity right now. Over the past three weeks, thieves haven't just been cutting lines, but they've been taking entire units. I'm not talking one or two AC units, but nearly a dozen. There was about four here. Yeah, they took four uh, last Thursday. Matt Conflitty says the group who stole these AC units knew what they were doing, leaving little behind. I think they just got around the box to get the lock off. They didn't cut the lock okay. and then yeah, just just cut the power and the, and the refrigerant lines. This is home security footage showing a group believed to be responsible for the thefts. We just have people walking and kind of casing around the area okay. and then we have the truck driving away. It didn't seem like something easy to pull off, but you know, especially four of them. Over the past three weeks, thieves have been methodically going after AC units or cutting lines at this townhome complex next to the old Tiger Stadium in Corktown. They cut all six of these lines. I don't know if they were just frustrated and it was vandalism because these two weren't even cut all the way through. It was just like a pinhole, but that was enough to do to drain all the refrigerant out and be a thousand dollars worth of damage. The thefts are outside the HOA, leaving homeowners on the hook. Three thousand dollars is not not cheap plus the time it takes and it's getting hot out too. So that's not going to be fun. With temps next week hitting 80 and higher, getting AC units replaced is no quick fix. Those were taken three weeks ago and they still don't have them replaced because you have to go through police report. You have to do the homeowner's insurance. You have to find the contractor that's available. Uh, you know, just to get the line repaired, I was getting quotes over a thousand dollars in 10 days to come to come fix that. Fortunately, it's not, you know, like a breaking entering type situation, but it's still it's still scary and homeowners are banding together. They want to invest in better security cameras. They've already put up some lights. They're hoping for more police patrols in the area in Corktown. I'm Priya Mann, local four.